Yeah. Oh, he's, he's here? Yeah. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm good. Mummy's out of trip. Said I'm gonna miss you. Well, uh, daddy. This is kiss. It's a massive van just for me. We're at the airport. Oh god. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. And you. made it through I made it through security guys <laughs> mm, yeah that was the most peaceful check-in ever if that was a flight that was headed to Nigeria no comment but yeah anyway I checked in my bags and you know when you're just about to let the bag go on the on the um thing the thing you know what I mean the belt you're thinking, oh, maybe I can take some stuff out of my hand luggage. But then the thing goes and you're like, oh, it's fine. Then I get to security and I had a whole heap of liquids <laughs> that I couldn't put in my suitcase. Thankfully, I have a calm disposition. And I was like, right, I have a plan. I, I packed my three plastic bags of liquids. One person, you know, that, that ain't gonna fly in Heathrow. Heathrow, if you're not um, sharp. And when I tell you, the hand, the sharp hand movement I had to make in order to just basically put my plastic bags in other people's trays. <laughs> Why am I like this? I managed to get all of my liquids through. I wasn't throwing any of that stuff away. So flipping expensive. Um, so yeah, but. Heathrow is pretty boring at this time of morning. Nothing's open and all there is to do is eat bread. So yeah, let me just grab something because I know that flight ain't feeding nobody. So my first flight is from Heathrow to Lisbon and then from Lisbon to Accra. All right, what am I gonna eat? Just landed in Lisbon and the sun is shining. Absolutely beautiful. I've never actually been to Portugal, so I'm definitely gonna have to come and visit at another point. So now for my connecting flight. Thank God there was someone giving directions to where to connect because we don't actually have that long layover in in um, Lisbon. It's really quite short. Hmm, the airport's quite nice. I don't know what I expected. <laughs> anyway, let me get a move on. Mm. 
very, very busy. Okay, need to find my passport quickly because they're moving quite fast. So this is my gate, gate 44. Ah, look at my life. Okay, so nice. much. Thank you so much. Ooh. That was close. Just made it to the gate. <laughs> Thing is, our flight literally just landed 10 minutes ago. But we were waiting ages to get out. So they're, they're saying last call. Oh, thank God they organized at this airport. So busy over there. So I'm gonna go the back way because I know I'm already sitting at the back. So yeah. Hi. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Is this one? Good afternoon, all blinds are open. Upper Portland, good share with its Star Alliance partners, wishes you an excellent fight. Thank you.
Oh, thank you so much. Yeah. My welcome. first time in Ghana. Oh, nice, nice, nice. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you very yeah. much. Sam is taking me via VIP. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Sam, should I say? Oh, <laughs> thank you so much. Sorry? Cassie called me and asked me, is it is a flight delay? I say yes. Oh. The time came down and then went up again. Went back up. Oh, yeah, we arrived a little bit early though. Yeah. We're meant to arrive. 10 past 3, no? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah. oh, look at that. Okay. Oh, like Beautiful airport. Thank you so much. so much <laughs> yes <laughs> four years now mm -hmm. thank you so much uh, on here oh this the right hand yeah the other hand thank you ma thank you god bless you <laughs> hi it's a beautiful airport look at that wow she is she is <laughs> Welcome to Canada. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already feeling it, <laughs> but it's good. I, all the time, I do. So. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. but Ghana is so different. Everyone's so calm. calm. Oh my <laughs> God! <laughs> even you know what? I'll tell you a story. Even like yeah. even the check-in was so calm. I was the only Nigerian like trying to open my suitcase. I said, No, I'm not going to embarrass myself. All the Ghanaians were so organized. I'm there with my suitcase open, oh <laughs> like my changing God. stuff around. <laughs> Wow. Hey, feel the heat. Oh my god. I myself gas. I'm actually glad I came early. <laughs> I'm so glad because I kind of needed to just settle. <laughs> Very close to the airport. It's like 15 minutes. Yeah, now, right now we are in Osu, and where I'm staying is where Labani. Yeah, Labani. L A B O N E. Labani. Okay, and it's all pretty, pretty, pretty it's close. Yeah, so all this is yeah. police barracks. Oh, okay. No filming here, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna put my phone down. I don't want any trouble, please. So this is police barracks. Uh huh. And then this is police hospital here. Okay. And then we're about to enter Osu. So this is down for a circle. You'll see like entering Osu is like entering. It's actually called Oxford Street. Yes. That's, that's what I was when so I was looking like for entering it. Piccadilly. <laughs> right. So we're properly central then. Yes. 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 Got it. And I left Osu. And that's number one. That's, that's number that, one. Number one. <laughs> so this circle indicates you're like going into Osu. They call it down right. circle. Right. 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 I see the, the sign as well. I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'll figure it out within the first day or so. I'm going to be out and about. Out and about. So all down. Up and down Oxford Street is vendors. Vendors, like, uh, you know, selling random and stuff. And yeah. Juries. Um, but we'll go to the market. Um, you guys will get a chance to go to the market. Like, so yeah, right. because I'm not going to try. Okay, so if I, just, if I got this, I would have just been right here. Yeah, How close I are we? down that street. Ah, uh, okay. Look at your hair! So I know! Finally! First time! Ever! 
ever. Ever, ever, ever. You always come next door and... I know. Never. Never been to Ghana. Can you imagine? I know. Your hair looks so nice. And you met Sam Square. Sam Square. Uh -huh. Sam and Sam. Sam and Sam. Square. Just started already. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's good. Uh, you give me a tune and we'll go somewhere. Yeah, I think that's yeah, hmm. seen anything. Yes. Oh my god, Kathy! Look at us! Yay! Buka! What about this? Because these things have been here before COVID. Okay. Thank you, in Africa. Please. Way before COVID. People thought. That We've been washing our hands, we've been recycling, all these things that you guys, that's new in the West. Right. We've been doing this for a long time. <laughs> yeah. Ah. So we'll see Emma in like some oh my God. Uh, boy and stuff like that. <gasps> oh my God, I'm home. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, how are you? Hi, good afternoon. Oh, it's beautiful. Okay. Cass, I'm, I hope I'm not like stopped. I hope. I know you got stuff to do about Africa. You, it, it, just got, it, it makes me disgruntled about Africa because, like, thank you so much. <laughs> mm. Oh, yes. Cheers, madame. Oh. Body and fire. <laughs> yummy. Delicious. Oh, yummy. <laughs> She's like, get yeah, both for her. <laughs> you need to share with me, babes. Well, of course, me. I can't just take one thing. This is the bomb diggity. Oh my days. Mm. I'm sure they were thinking, oh, she's probably not going to turn up. Well, whew, what a welcome to Ghana. I am well and truly stuffed. We had such we just had some drama with my booking. My original hotel called me saying, oh, we have a problem. Sorry, my Ghanaian accent is terrible. But they had a problem. The person that was there before. I thought you were sitting over there. <laughs> the person that was there before, basically. Yeah, long story short, I had no room. But everything happens for a reason. Uh, yes, over here. <laughs> um, everything happens for a reason because I was asking my girl Cass if there was a gym and she's like oh you know all the other gyms are far but the new place that I'm in has a gym so it is well <laughs> I just cannot wait to get to my room have a shower unpack and just chill but my first few hours in Ghana has been amazing <laughs> so nice to be back home so when, yeah, so when you decided to move home, did you have any fears that you were going to be like, I don't know, did you have any fears whatsoever? Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't, the crazy thing is I want to say, I want to say yes, but I did it only because I've been coming every single year and my right. family lives here already and I stayed for extended periods. Yes. So when I came, you knew the it was the like, land. oh yeah, I already had my barber, my gym, my church, my this, my that. Like I already right. had my stuff and my friend network was built from Christmases decades ago. Like, right. so I had all my, my people, actually I'm not going this way, sorry. And like, Sorry, apologies. You're, you're so comfortable driving as well. You're like driving like a real Ghanaian. <laughs> like, apologies. <laughs> but Ghanaians don't say sorry. They no. just do it. They just go. <laughs> it's just, just go. They just I love it. Do it. No, we're ready. I'm ready to move home. Yeah. It feels nice. It feels but yeah, nice. Yeah, when you have your, as with anywhere you move, and yes. you, when you have your people and your things, yeah, it will be it's easy. Yeah. Those are the things that make you scared because you're scared to be alone. That you don't right. have anybody to. But I know my dad's here, my cousin's here, my exactly. Like, my friends' group is here. So. Exactly. Woo! And it's home. And then next year will be our 10-year anniversary of of having our tour group. Oh my goodness! Yes. So Cass is like, I mean, everywhere we go, Cass is basically famous anyway. But um, she has a tour. Shut it. <laughs> she has a tour group called Africa with us 
and they tour all over Africa basically and it's vibes, fitness, um, tourism, history, everything, food, culture, you name it. And this weekend we are coming to celebrate her, the queen that she is. But basically she's put us she's put a whole program together for us. So I I'm I am like doubly excited and honored to be on an Africa with us tour <laughs> plus <laughs> celebrating this young lady being 40 and fire. 40 and fire. I got my nails done fire and fire colors. Literally fire. <laughs> Literally fire because we're going to celebrate. Hey. She's on fire. This girl is on fire. Okay, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> <laughs> right, onto my new apartment. Apparently, I'm so excited that I actually have a gym because that was the thing I was concerned about. I see how things work out for good. All things work out for good. <laughs> it's about 8 p.m. finally in my Airbnb. So the first one cancelled on me however everything works out for good because now i'm in a space it's a lovely little space and the place i'm staying in has pools it's dark outside so i can't really show you now but it has pools and it has a nice gym which is perfect because i love me at an early morning workout but for now it's good night because I've been, I've had about two hours sleep since yesterday. Yeah, <laughs> it's been a long day. So good night.